look of Abdurakmanov earlier on. Just looking to see where he lost out. Lost out to the number one seed, David Mura, but he had a good win against Stanislav Bondarenko. It was an interesting contest. Bondarenko ended up grabbing his leg and getting penalized for that. There you go. He's got some movement for a big fella, hasn't he? Nice strong attack, left left sided there. Oh, Sotagari. Heinlock managed to avoid getting caught. And quite rightly doesn't want that left hand anywhere near him. But he runs the risk of getting called for avoiding to take a grip. He's spending so much time fighting off that left hand. That was poor. Once the left hand went on, Heinle just went to ground. Never really moved Abdurakmanov with that. to Rachmanov, who picks up the penalty. He's the one who then comes in with the Makikomi attack. Heinle missed with that attempt to engage Abdul Rachmanov on the ground. That's a bit better. Try to use this now, the Tajik fighter. He's got the grip that he was looking for. Got to be brave enough to go over there. There's the left leg sticking out. Why didn't he attack it? It's not Abdurakmanov that's pushing off. Yeah, that's, that's who was doing the pushing off. It was blue. Sven Heinler. Mr. Wong not having the best of tournaments. A couple of times. He's given things the wrong way, I'm afraid to say. He's given the right decisions, he's just given them to the wrong players. <laughs> That's what Abdurakmanov should be doing. That was poor, he didn't even have his hands on him. Well, we got the ending that we were looking for. Poor old Sven Heinler on the end of that huge burial from Abdurakmanov. It showed that kind of the possibility that he could produce something like that earlier on. Abdurakmanov, bronze medalist.